Hi folks, uh, just a very quick video. I got a, a new um, dosimeter today, a digital one, um, all the way from Ukraine. Uh, this is the EcoTest Therapy, um, purchased from Ukraine and uh, got here in uh, three days, incredibly. Um, very, very, very quick postage. Nice little unit. Um, let's turn it on here quickly, but it, uh, what I like about it is it's very, very quick. So if you do have a, uh, if you want to do a quick, you know, check on a, you know, a, a radioactive source, it uh, it updates itself very, very quickly. Now you can see it flashing here. What it does is it, it takes a uh, 70 second um, average of the uh, the background radiation level and uh, then it's, it's sort of good to go. Uh, difference being that these two meters, this is the GMC 300E, this sort of gives you a real time um, update and it doesn't give you an average, it just uh, ticks away. So it, you'll find this one fluctuates a bit more. Uh, same with uh, the Rad Alert 50, it um, will count for 60 seconds and then updates every every 60 seconds. So it's quite a good one as well. It's reasonably quick. Uh, the, the GMC 300 is quite slow. Um, it's not bad though um, and it's, it does quite high readings as well. Um, the therapy when it's flashing, um, that's it sort of doing it 70 seconds when it stops flashing and it's picks up. So you can already see it's pretty much worked out the average. These two have been on for about five minutes and it's already sort of picked up the reading. Um, it, uh, it's gamma at the moment, but if I take off this little shield, um, you can see this little shield, here's a little bit of lead on it. And, uh, we have the uh, the Geiger Muller tube inside there, so if you want to do uh, PSD beta readings or beta readings, you can uh, you can do it with that off. Uh, takes uh, two uh, AAA batteries, and supposedly that will last you over a year of normal use. Um, after about five minutes, it switches itself off, sort of in standby mode, and uh, it gives you your accumulated dose. So there's your accumulated dose, and that's measured in millisieverts. And then you have the time. Uh, you can put a, a, a timer on it as well, alarm feature. And then that's just your normal, uh, you know, the dose rate. But uh, there is there is an alarm on it that if it if it goes above thirty uh, microsieverts, the alarm will go off. Now I might have to do it with the beta window open, but. There, there's the alarm going off. So that's a bit of uh, urinal zinc acetate. And uh, that has a bit of uranium in it. And as you can see, it sets the alarm off and that goes up to, uh, that was up to nine microsieverts there. But yeah, just wanted to very, very quickly show you this. Um, just got it today from uh, Ukraine. And uh, these are the meters that they give you at Chernobyl when you're visiting Chernobyl. And uh, I just thought I would preempt going to Chernobyl. You usually rent them when you go to Chernobyl, but I thought I'd buy one um, as it, it looked like a nice little device. And uh, I bought it through the tour company that I'm going. I'm going to Chernobyl in May. So I bought it through the tour company and got a really good discount on it. And uh, a nice little addition to my meters. So that's uh, sort of three of the little digital meters I have here. And then I've got about another four or five Geiger counters. So that I actually I can use. So I think in a video coming up soon, I'll do a... I'll do a little video on all the Geiger counters I have. But uh, yeah, just wanted to show this very quickly. See you later. Bye-bye.